Individuals are not allowed to take home pets, which have been collected while off the jungle crew. Herds of elephants have been seen bathing in several regions of the Bangkok River. Since these animals have been known to spray water at passing yeah, I sank my last boat, but that's beneath me now. So. Yeah, if you guys reach under your seats, that's actually your sense of humor. Go ahead and grab that for me. You're gonna need it out there. <laughs> Alrighty, but thank you for sitting in the doorway to keep the water from coming in. Alrighty, folks. And it looks like we are clear. Not everybody raise your hands and wave goodbye to those skippers on the dock. We are never gonna see them again. But that's okay. You guys have never seen them before, so that really doesn't matter, does it? Now wave goodbye to my biggest fans all the way up there. Yeah, we just got those for Christmas last year. They have like four streets on them. They're so cool. My name is Skipper Adriel. I'm going to be your skipper for today. But before we get started, just as a quick reminder, please stay seated for me with your hands, your arms, your legs, and your feet. Inside the boat. Parents, please watch children. Children, please watch your parents. I don't trust them either, okay? Is anybody riding the Jungle Cruise for the first time ever? Yeah, me too, guys. I'm so excited. You have no idea. But I actually do believe in nautical law. Nautical law says that the captain of this ship must go down with the ship. What's your name, by the way? Trevor. Trevor. Everybody say hi to Captain Trevor for me. Thank you so much. Let's get started here in the Amazon. Do you guys hear that water falling sound? Yeah, we like to call that a waterfall. And we like to call this waterfall Inspiration Falls. Now, the reason why we call it Inspiration Falls is the more you look at it, guys, the more they will inspire you to go. That's right, deeper and deeper into the jungle. Now, everybody say, ooh. Everybody say, ah. Oh. Wow, I don't know about you guys, but that sounded like a whole lot of inspiration. So cool. But we're entering the Congo River now. Let's see how far we Congo. Ah. They are not going to get any better, guys. <laughs> yeah, by the way, it sounds like the pig villagers are having a party for you guys um, to welcome you here to the jungle. I've invited all my friends. They're all really funny. So everybody go ahead and wave hello. Nobody showed up. That actually reminds me a lot of my 16th birthday. Nobody showed up to that either. Oh. Yeah, maybe oh, something scared them off, honestly. I don't know. What <laughs> It's a giant python. Yeah, and I know what you guys are thinking. Wow, she's really cute. But trust me, you don't want to get tangled up in a relationship like that. It can be quite constricting. Yeah, she's a real snake, if you know what I mean. But this is my camp. I did some organizing, some decorating. Oh, no! Who let my in-laws in today? Yeah, that's okay. I can't be too mad at them. They got my Jeep to turn over. I could not get it started this morning. Yeah, maybe they call triple eight. I don't, I don't know. Triple eight. Don't know. But guys, we are entering the Nile River. The Nile River is the longest river in the world. It goes on for Niles and Niles and Niles. And if you don't believe me, folks, you're definitely in disbelief. But thank you so much for trying. I appreciate it. Yeah. Hey, buddy. That's an African bull elephant, guys. You know, it's very important that we treat these animals with respect. They're actually very... Why? What do you want? Why is that? I'll tell him. Jeez. <laughs> he wants me to tell you that there's a Jungle Cruise movie coming out this year called The Jungle Cruise. Yeah, this is the star of the movie, The Rock. I know, I know, I know, so cool. And this is the African belt. I'm going to show you some cool animals here. We have the gray cows that killed Mufasa right there. We have a 1971 Impala on top of the hill. And that right there, kids, we have a sleeping zebra. Yeah, you know, that's how zebras sleep in the wild, surrounded by lions. Yeah, she actually looks dead tired. So we're just going to move on and let her rest in peace, okay? Hakuna Matata. Oh, no. Look at that. You don't see that every day. Yeah, well, I do. I kind of work here, but you see the guy at the bottom of that pole? His name is a Huntus. It looks like that rhino's trying to poke a Huntus. <laughs> yeah, but just around the riverbed. <laughs> Guys, I am killing it right now, honestly. <laughs> I do want to show you some cool plants we have here in the jungle. All the way up there, we have some hibiscus. 
Right there in the bottom, we have some low biscuits. Yeah, and in the water, we have some sea biscuits. Yeah. I'll be here all day, unfortunately, it's true. But that right there, that's the beautiful Schweitzer Falls, everybody. Now, Schweitzer Falls was named after the world-famous African explorer, Dr. Albert Falls. And if you don't get it, that's okay. We'll go over it later. Now, everybody, breathe that in for me. Woo! Oh, so refreshing. Doesn't that feel great? Oh, so cool. Moisturize a little, guys. Soak it into your pores. Yeah, so refreshing. That's actually packed full of jungle bacteria. Everybody on this boat, you're going to feel it in 48 hours. By the way, have you been asking yourself, well, Skipper Adriel, how did you land your jungle cruise? It's pretty plain to see, folks, that had a crash course. Yeah, but to be honest with you guys, I've kind of just been winging it, you know? <laughs> What'd you call me? Oh, hippo! Yeah, sorry. Sorry, guys. It's okay. I'm a tree professional, okay? I've been hey! <laughs> A piece of my gun. <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna scare them off like I scared off my ex girlfriend, okay? I love you! Now, <laughs> yeah, don't worry, folks, we're never gonna see you. <laughs> see them again. Oh, that's gone forever. Guys, it looks like we're heading into headhunter territory. That's a horrible place to be headed. If you don't believe me, you can just ask my last crew over there. They're all a bunch of boneheads, honestly. Yeah, and over here we have some natives doing some kind of circle dance. You know what that means, right? Yeah, they forgot a square dance. It's a real shame. Uh, and then some skippers told me to look out for a rare jungle bush called an ambush. So, oh, ambush! Everybody get down, get down, get down! Don't worry about looking silly, I'm doing that for you! Ah! Use your children as cover! <laughs> hey, if you got hit by a spear, please throw it right back at them. We can't keep souvenirs. Nothing's free. Except our smile. Love it! Honestly, I think we actually might be family because you're not being very supportive right now. <laughs> this is the Mekong River deep in the heart of Cambodia. Yeah, I've actually never seen that place before. I don't know what's in there. There could be danger. There could be treasure. But this is Walt Disney World, so it might just be another gift shop. <laughs> yep. Guys, I was wrong. It actually looks like it's going to be a root canal. <laughs> Water coming out of their trunks? It's not. 
Over here, though, to my left hand side, folks, we have my best friend in the world, Trader Sam. Everybody say hi, Sam. Hi, Sam. Now, Trader Sam is the head salesman here in the jungle, but sales have been shrinking for quite some time. So he's having a great deal for you guys today. He wants to give you two of his heads for just one of yours. Yeah, any way you cut it, slice it or dice it, folks, you're coming out ahead. But it does look like we're making it to the most dangerous part of our journey today, the return to civilization. <laughs> so please, stay seated for me with your hands, your arms, your legs, and your feet inside the boat. If not, you might experience some peer pressure on that dock, okay? <laughs> Guys, out of all the crews that I've had so far today, you've definitely been the most recent. <laughs> today we cried together, we laughed together, we all nearly died together out there in the jungle. So I think that makes us like a little family. And like any little family, I'm gonna tell you the same thing my mom said to me when I was 18. She said, hey, Drill, mijo, I love you, buddy, but get out. I'm sorry, that was rude. Please get out. Thank you. Oh, wow, thank you. Some pity applause by my coworkers. And a standing ovation. Thank you so much. Guys, enjoy the rest of your day here at the Magic Kingdom, or as I like to call it, work. Yeah.